I want to repeat. Yes. If I am a witch, Jesus is a bigger witch than me. Because I got this thing from breaking bread and feeding it to people from Jesus. If I am a witch, Jesus is the biggest witch doctor in the whole wide world. He's the first thing I see. He took five loaves, two fish, and started feeding it to the people. If he's a witch, I'm a witch. If Jesus, if I'm a witch, Elijah is also a witch. If all of this, I am a witch. That means Paul is also a witch. Because they took from his body handkerchief. He took from his body the handkerchief and gave it to the people. Step back to They took from his body a handkerchief and put it on the sick people. Put it on their children. Put it on their loved ones. And if I was an evil spirit, departed from them. I even I even I even give out the the prayer towels that have been on my altar for nine years. Elijah is AKA witch doctor number two. And I am a witch. Paul is a first class chariot witch. Because he allowed people to take his handkerchief. And they was healed and delivered. And they started manifesting. And they were set free. So I give a word. And I give a warning. And they say, oh, she let people touch her. A garment. Well, they touch Jesus' garment. Am I not a son of God? Am I not a child of God? Listen, I am not in the same class with Jesus. I am just a servant of God. I am a son of God. You are a son of God. And the world is waiting for the sons of God to manifest. If, if I have the kind of faith that permits me to pray over anything. That's right. Don't mess with me. If I can find David five stones with the one we killed, the lion will not pray over that minute. Listen, if I can find Samson jawbone of the ass and chuck that up in a hundred pieces and say, oh, oh, oh.